Hi, and welcome to this interior rendering in XSI training presented by Digital Tutors. My name's Kyle, and for the next several hours, I'm going to be your instructor as we explore some of the various techniques involved in setting up realistic lighting for your interior renders. Now, the ability to set up realistic lighting for an interior environment is a skill that's very highly sought after in the CG industry today. And it's a skill that's used very, very heavily in feature films, games, broadcast, and architectural visualizations, just to name a few areas. But every digital set comes with its own unique set of problems that need to be overcome. So we're going to be covering a lot of the very common issues that you want to be aware of, such as achieving realistic light bouncing effects in our interior environments. We'll take a look at some techniques we can use to prevent areas of unwanted light spilling. We'll also look at how we can modify geometry in our scene to fix a lot of very common lighting errors. And we'll also take a look at how we can output our final renders in multiple passes, as well as a few techniques that we can use in an external image editing application just to add a few finishing touches to our final renders. So after you complete this training, you're going to be able to light and render your own interior sets and environments with a much stronger understanding of how to overcome a lot of the very common issues that you'll be facing when setting up realistic lighting effects in XSI. So as you can see, we have a lot of material to cover over the course of the next few hours. So in the next lesson, we'll go ahead and get started.